Okay, an opening for Bloodworth. Here we go. Hi, everybody. This is Bossman v. Wozniak. I am the Bossman. I am the one trying to defeat Wozniak's high score. Not the one that he currently holds, but the one he sent to Nintendo Power under his backwards name so many years ago. That's what I'm trying to take down, Buster. Uh, we are emulating Tetris, but I own Tetris the cartridge for Game Boy. Here it is. We own this. We love this. This is uh, one of the greatest games ever. I'm using a Super Nintendo iBuffalo controller, which I may replace in the near future. Uh, Thursday Postal just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Thursday Postal. Hey, should I, should I promote that? If you have Amazon Prime, you can subscribe to this channel for free. Uh, I don't know why Twitch is doing that, but basically we just made a lot of money from Amazon today. Amazon lost a lot of money today, giving away so many free Twitch subscriptions. I don't get their model. It scares me a little bit. It seems like Amazon's always been cool with losing money to get money later. I don't know what your long play is, Amazon, but for now, we appreciate it. Easy allies, we're cool with that. Uh, Demling B-type here. All right, let's start to Tetris. Let's start to play. Uh, Tooks just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Tooks. Uh, Took is a Canadian word for hat, and I wonder if that is what that is. Or it could be anything, really. Hollywood Hasney subscribed seven months in a row. Thank you, Hollywood Hasney. Uh, Mind Dude Plays just subscribed with Twitch Prime. This is exciting. Look at all these people roll in. Weird. Okay, um... Let's uh, hold down as we press start, because we're doing our training in the hyperbolic time chamber. Going to level 15 as opposed to 5, to train in high speeds. Okay, uh, should I prep you for your bets? Betting is open at this point. I have to say, I'm feeling very exhausted. Uh, obviously, I was trying not to do midnight streams anymore, but uh, this week, had a sketch show, late night, had to do what I had to do. Uh, we're here at midnight again. Um, am I going to be bad tonight? Most likely. Let's just be ready for that. Let's be prepared. If your bets are high, maybe lower them. If you want to believe, believe. Um, I made a mistake. Uh, sorry. Fish Kish Music subscribed five months in a row. Thank you, Fish Kish Music. I wonder if you're a fish fan? And I don't understand the Kish part. Oh, well. Uh... Excuse me. Oh my gosh, Tapioks. That's why training went so bad. Thank you so much for being on top of this. Uh, we forgot the most impar important part of training. Usain Bolt. Okay, so let's redo level 15 again. Um, now we'll do much, much better. And click right in there. Yeah, I need a little, I need a production team on this. Okay. We'll just do it in level 15 one more time. This time with the power of Usain. Mm-hmm. Much better already. Look at this. Thank you, Usain. Mm-hmm. He inspires us to work harder. To be a better human. Action69 subscribed two months in a row. Great name. What's up, Kyle? Let's make it to 400k. Buddy, I would love to tonight. Uh, odds are bad, but you know I want it. The will is strong. Usain is here for us. For training, anyway. He leaves when it's game time. Mm hmm. Whatever, we'll do that. We'll do that. It's not a Tetris, but, uh. Some level 15 stuff. There we go. Look at him. Look at him. Look at that confidence. Nice! Cozy Life subscribed five months in a row. Thank you, Cozy Life. Yeah, it's like, uh, do you remember when Walmart was really taken off? Walmart had the cheapest prices on everything. And you said, what's your game here, Walmart? And they said, we want to, uh, run everyone else out of business. And they were kind of successful in doing that. Is that what Amazon's up to here? They're trying to run everyone else out of business? Who cares? I mean, Twitch Prime. It's, it's here. Why would you say no? It's too much of a good thing. Starburst fave reds. Mm 
Nice, nice, nice. Now this is good. This is us learning high-speed stuff. I know it looks like a mess, but it's a really good warm-up. Uh, just to get tuned in. I don't mind it. Gets me mashing. Four zero six just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, KP. Mhm. Mm Great. Uh, everyone, I haven't seen any betting in a while. Betting is still open. Do not be afraid to bet right now. You could become the pilot of the Buran. Uh, the entrance fee is zero dollars and zero cents. Much like your Twitch Prime subscriptions. co-pilots. I do not know. I guess... Uh, only Benny Samuelson would know what happens if we have ties. Uh, I slammed that down there because we had a box coming up next. Like right there. You gotta accommodate for boxes sometimes. Treat them like your special guests. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, see, I could have waited for that tea, huh? Alright. Uh, that run's gone on long enough. We had a good run there. That was a fine run. How do I get the A next to my name? Bruno, you have it on my screen. Brunobi. Brunobi02. I totally see an A next to your name. Mission accomplished in your case. sucks. Let's clean up already. Let's start cleaning up. Nice. That line will help. Um, personally, I got... Ugh, I did that backwards. That sucked. That was a bad call. Uh, personally, I got Amazon Prime when I was ordering parts from my PC. And I was doing so many shipments, so many pieces, and I wanted them all as soon as possible. I didn't want them all spaced out two weeks apart. That I just kind of considered it an extra expense on top of my uh, PC. And I don't regret having it. Amazon Prime's not bad. It's just, it's not cheap. It's not cheap. I mean, you get 30 days trial for free, you know? I guess you get that. Ooh, that was some good mashing. That was some good stuff. Hmm. Kyle, what are you thinking there, bud? It's, it's fast. It's just hard to think. Ooh, that was some good mashing, too. No, no, nice, nice, nice. Okay. Uh, Stupid Pros brings up that you also get discounts on new games with Amazon Prime, which is also very true. Uh, I think they match, basically, what Best Buy does. And so, yeah, you get a ridiculous discount for buying new games that have just come out. Hmm. Obviously, I made the wrong call there. That's a situation where I didn't know what to do when I got two lines. That was weird. Oh, Kyle, that was weird stuff, dude. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh, this is weird. He's doing weird stuff. Okay. All right, we're all done. We're all done with 17. Honestly, not a bad 17 run. Um, I just slipped up a lot at the end. Uh, small MCM just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Small. Boop. All right, we're going to level 18. Here we go. Uh, I will shut off the betting at the end of training... Ooh, let's see if we can do it. Dang. Okay. I'm gonna try 18 again. So 18, I can't get a Tetris on. I can't get a natural Tetris. 
We can maybe get a Goldblum Tetris at level 18. Uh, but... Uh, the Tetris is I like, which I just referred to as a natural Tetris, um, you can't get on level 18. There's simply no fingers that can mash hard enough. Uh, I'm doing weird stuff again. Hold on, let me try that again. Uh, Big T3845 just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Big T. That's so weird. That's so weird. Uh, basically, we make the same cut as a regular subscriber through these strange, strange uh, Twitch Prime subscriptions. That all goes to Easy Allies. Well, I mean, not all of it. Okay. Um, what I want to... Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. I had a mission here. I, I'm totally distracted. Uh, I'm going to try to Gold Bloom at level 18. Let's see if that is feasible. <sighs> okay. Plan interrupted. Girl interrupted. Could you make that movie today? All right, one more attempt. Oop. Two hearts. Okay, can we gold bloom at level 18? That is the goal right now. Can we do it? Can we get a Tetris down the middle? Or am I simply not enough of a Tetris genius? Yeah, 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 I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. We had the setup. It didn't happen. I'm not enough of a Tetris genius to make it happen. Okay, so I guess for tonight at least, uh, level 18, it's definitely time to go for rivers and lakes. Um, otherwise, uh, yeah, we're not getting a Tetris out of that stuff. I'll try it. I'll try it at level 19. Uh, at this point, it's more about luck. You know what I mean? It's more about getting that line right now. There it is. Okay. We got a little level 19 Tetris. But, uh, that was dumb luck, and oh boy, oh boy. See, this is, uh, <laughs> this is why we're talking about getting a new controller, is human errors. The stuff where I, uh, don't mash hard enough or overmash. Alright, and we'll do one more 19, then we're cutting off training, we're cutting off the betting. Here we go. That was cool, though. We got a little Tetris in there, that was not bad. Ugh. I just hate when everything is so nice and straight, and then you get an S or a Z. I mean, I guess S's and Z's are common, so what could you expect? But they pop up. We don't need them. We don't want it. Kyle, what does overmashing have to do with a controller? Uh, just it's mushy. It's kind of a mushy D-pad, if I had to describe it. Again, obviously I make many judgment errors that I could never blame on a controller. But there are times when a real dumb thing happens on account of some slips of the finger. And I wonder if those could be avoided. I truly wonder. See, right there, man, uh, an expert pro masher could really turn that into something. I simply can't move my thumb fast enough. Oh, well. Okay, so let me uh, lock down the bets. Let me do this. Oh my goodness, computer, work with me here, bud. All right. Let me close this, and then this, and then this, and then let me officially lock down the betting. No longer live. 178 bets tonight. Pretty good, everybody. Okay, uh, Usain has to leave us. Thanks for training with us, buddy. Okay, you're gone, and I'm going to reset, and then we're going to actually play some Tetris. Beep, 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 beep. Um, reset. Where is it? That's under Other. Other. Reset Game Boy. Kyle, I use the iBuffalo controller. I wouldn't call the D-pad mushy. Maybe unless you press it hard, maybe. I do press it hard. Press it hard. So I had to cancel my sub, but I won't be able to use Prime Sub until this current Tetum is over, right? Or should I be able to do it now? Deadpool Pew Pew, I see a crown and an A next to you. So I don't know. I don't know if anything wrong is happening. Uh, A-type? A-type. 
Arigato Bolt Coon. I like that. It's goodbye, Usain. See you next week. I really like our uh, attachment to Usain. Oh my goodness. Stepping out of the hyperbolic time chamber always feels so nice. What a relief. Stress is gone. Be gone, stress. Look at Kyle being a little timid tonight. Not a good sign, to be honest with you. Uh, Tetris? I don't know. At some point, like, wisdom helps you. But also, like, you need that esports brain. Alright, fine. Fine. Okay, now we can work with my little mess over here. It's fine. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that, we'll do that, and we'll do that. Nice, get some lines. Beautiful. And then we're gonna have to do some gold bloom, but uh, this ain't bad. I could have done something way smarter there. It's okay. It's all good. We're ready. And then, nice. Joey shows up, and we're ready for some more gold blooming. This is great. Thank you, Joey. though. Great. We'll do a little of that, and a little bit of that. Nice. Okay, and then we're ready. We're ready for a little... There we go! Nice! Right on cue that time. Beautiful. So yeah, as you can see, if you're gold blooming, you gotta work a little harder for it. It's not ideal to me. Oh, these boxes. Beautiful. They're making us work. Making us sweat. Sweat it out. Do we do it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's be nice and clean. I like that. Keep it clean. For the kids. Kids are watching. Let's keep it clean. Let's get a Tetris. Beautiful. It's a beautiful Tetris. Uh, okay, so what I did there was uh, buying into the gambler's fallacy. And here, it paid off there. Or, or, I mean, it, it proved the case there. Uh, basically, I was thinking, I got so many lines in a row, there's no way I'll get another line soon. Uh, that's simply an incorrect way to think. Uh, and in that case, we got three lines there, almost back to back to back. Uh, but... If it wasn't back to back to back and simply back to back, we would have been hosed, and so you know. I bought in. I bought into superstition, which is an enemy when it comes to defeating Wozniak. Don't do it. Don't buy into superstitions. Okay. Real mess there. Worst possible stuff. Not the worst. Nice. Cleaned it up pretty quick. Ready for more Tetrises. Beautiful. Look at that. That was really cool. That was bad stuff turned beautiful. She's all that. We got Usher at our prom. Beautiful. Chat, how old is Usher? How old is he? He's been working so long. Hmm. Okay. The box. I really don't know what to do with it. 
Chat says 42 years old. Nice. Yo, your time. I see you. I like it. Okay. We're in the clear again. Ready to continue the Tetris Madness. Okay, chat also says 37, 36 I think. Why is no one just Googling it? I guess we're glued to the screen is why you're not Googling it. If I can answer for you, it's... I'm glued to the screen right now. If you're gonna beat 400K, I wanna see it, buddy. I don't wanna be trapped in a Google search looking up Usher's age when it finally goes down. All right, so right now I'm counting on a Z. Will it pay off? So far, no, but there it is. Cool, cool, cool. So yeah, so check that out. Uh, we burned two lines, but we kept pretty clean. Um, I'm sorry, that's an S. <laughs> I was counting on an S, but uh, <laughs> in my mind I knew what it was. Um, I'm still not used to calling those either of those shapes by their actual shapes. Nice. It's gonna get a dirty Tetris there. Uh, why I called that a dirty Tetris, sorry, um, is because we have a mess to clean up afterward. Normally I don't like to do those, but, uh, I'm learning from you. Chat, you always get so mad when I don't prioritize the Tetris and when I try to clog up the line ahead of time. And so now we kind of have a situation. Uh, we have a uh, L coming in. I'm not sure where to stash, stash it, but we'll find out. Greedy Cheese just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Greedy Cheese. Um, okay. Oh, boy. You wanted this, huh, chat? So that this is the price we pay for going for that Tetris, that ugly Tetris. When you tell me to never clog, this is what we get. Uh, fortunately, we are we are ahead of schedule in terms of our score, so it's not a huge deal. Uh, obviously, this is just going real bad, though. Joey comes in to help out. Thank you, Joey. And we're in good shape. So yeah, uh, that is why. That is why I stuff the box as often as I do, is so we don't have to deal with situations like this. Stuff the well. It's for that. So we don't do this. This is uh, slowing us down. Level 10 Tetrises are so easy to get, and instead we're dealing with this business. So, to make up for it, we're going to try to turn that right there into a gold bloom, if possible. Makes me nervous. Nice, we got it. Thank you, Sweeney. That was nice. That was a very nice space in between line pieces. We cannot expect that kind of generosity moving forward, but... Oh, oh that's very generous. Mr. Sweeney, come on, man. That's too nice. You're flattering me. Yeah, we're going for Tetris still. I'm definitely overthinking this. <sighs> yeah, sorry. I had to kill it. I needed. Dang, there you are. The generosity ended, chat, so that's why I had to do what I had to do there. Mm-hmm. It's all good. It's all good, baby. Whittle it down little by little. Mm-hmm. 
whittle it down. Cleanup crew, they know what they're doing. They've been through this. Highly trained professionals. They've seen this all before. Beautiful. All right, let's get some more Tetrises. Level 13 Tetrises, please. Nice, thank you so much, Sweeney. Whew. No panicking. No panicking, nobody was panicking. Not me, not you. It's super nice, Sweeney. Too kind right there. Let's move a little more toward the center here. Mm-hmm, very nice. Ready, oh my gosh! That kind of generosity is insane. That was too nice right there. I don't know how to handle it. It's like when somebody gives you too nice of a compliment, you're just bashful. You're making me blush tonight, Sweeney. Mm hmm, okay, nice. Look at Joey coming in clutch. Now we just need a tea? Well, you will do, actually. We'll take you. Mm-hmm. I'm ready for a Tetris again. Very nice. Look at that. It's like every time we ask for one, it just shows up. It's not right. We will get hosed eventually. Don't count on this happening the whole run. There's that slip! There's that slip I keep talking about! There it was, everybody! That run is over. Oh, there's that slip. So as you can see, at a higher level like that, slip and a run. That'll end it. Oh, that'll end it. That sucks. Yeah, a tough game. It's a game where you make a mistake, you're done. You're donezo. Was Dear Boss from the thing you couldn't talk about? Well, no, I mean, um... Oh yeah, we'll absolutely put a name in for that. Uh, Live with YouTube Gaming was a thing I couldn't talk about. But that is absolutely public now. There's no more secrets, really. That's the show I've been working on. That's my full-time job. Is a segment producer, making sure that thing happens. That might be our best first run of all time. That was pretty good. Granted, we got some really nice Sweeney in there. Sweeney hooked us up. Three, four, zero. Zero. Eight, five, one. Cool. Kyle, I'm playing Bioshock for the first time while I watch this. I'll let you know if I think it sucks. Please do JJ Stein. Kopf. Cool. Mm, Hugo Stiglitz, 87, subscribe with tip Twitch Prime. Thank you, Hugo Stiglitz. Is that your real name? If so, it's a great name. Oops. Uh, sounds like we're going with A-type music again. I'm back in. Full-time job, what about the allies? That is my part-time job. It is <laughs> um, definitely difficult to juggle both, I will admit. Um, but, hey, I'm holding up. I'm here. I'm here, baby. I'm there tomorrow. We're shooting some tabletop tomorrow. We're still doing Dumb Game Mondays. We're still doing the podcasts. It's all good. Yeah, I just didn't want to deal with the um, unevenness that that line would have created. Looks like I have no choice. Box appears. And again, that Tetris ain't worth it. It's not like I didn't see the Tetris there. Um, it simply wasn't worth effing everything else up to get it. 
We'll get it. We'll come around to it. It's fine. Joey, where are you, bud? Ooh, not Joey. I guess I need... Ah, look who shows up. L. Cool. So I'm mixing those up. I'm definitely mixing those up. Gross. There we go. Get a Tetris already. Mm-hmm. We'll keep getting Tetrises. That's cool. all fine. Uh-huh. Yeah. Nice, Joey. Thank you, bud. Dyslexia. Absolutely. I have super... I very much have Tetris dyslexia. I very much have it. So that's pretty bad. Uh, what I did there is I'm committing to pieces even at level 9, which is bad. That's a habit I have at higher levels, where I decide what I'm going to do with a piece before uh, it's loaded in, um, which is kind of a necessity at some point, but is absolutely not a necessity at level 9. You should be reacting to what's dropped on you at level 9. Dyslexia. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not sure that works. I'm not sure if we can really make a good pun out of uh, dyslexia and Tetris. I don't know how to make it work, chat. Nice, Joey. Great. Joey! Well done, Joey! that rolling. Joey MVP right now. Joey's doing, been doing great on this run. Yeah, that's alright. That's alright. That's alright. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah. Uh, one habit I've gotten into, which is really weird, is... Uh, mashing every time I get a Tetris just to, like, keep my thumb warmed up? That's weird. Mashing in a circle. And then look at Joey! MVP all night! Well done, bud! Uh, that sucks. S. Not an MVP. Have you ever swore at Tetris? Not live. I gotta assume it happened in real life at one point. Which I suppose would suggest that none of this is real life. I should say not publicly. Yeah, this is just rotten. What a rotten way to end this run. It ain't over yet, it just looks very much over. It is salvageable. We can do it. Mm-hmm. We can do this. Oh god, enough. That's cute, but enough.
Hmm, we're not gonna get to 200k, but I'm gonna keep this run going. I think we can do okay with this run. And we almost got there. Hey, that was real close. That's real close. That was some really good cleanup crew stuff. That run looked hopeless for a long time. And I guess that's why I wanted to keep it running, is uh, personal victory-wise. Uh-huh. We'll take it. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Speaking of wise, I gotta be honest with you, chat, I don't have any music queued up tonight. Um, Captain Hampton even figured out a very smart workaround to last week's issues. Uh, Captain Hampton made every single Boss from the Wozniak track uh, public commons? I forget how it works. Basically, uh, surrendered all rights to any track created for Boss from the Wozniak, just for us. Um, which is pretty cool. Alright, see, right there, that was almost uh, what I was referring to as an overmash, where uh, I hit the button one too many times. It was going to land a little too far to the left when we needed it one spot right. Uh, it was adjusted, but at least you got to see it in action, what I'm referring to. Alright, let's get a little gold boom stuff going on. Let's get it. Let's make it happen. We need it. Ah. Okay. Ah. Fine. They really insisted upon us really doing that. Hmm. Okay. Get the boss. So that was a bad spot for that. No, we're fine. We're actually fine. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Oh, gross. That might be the end of the run right there. Um, that wasn't a slip of the finger. That was simply not being fast enough. Can we do it? Nice! Keep it alive! Keep it alive! Cool, cool, cool. That was great. That was some good mashing. Yeah, I don't want that. We're going for Tetrises. You thought I would take the desperate cleanup? No, 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 no. Oh, now I have to. That sucks. You're so mean, Tetris. The one time we don't need a Joey. making us work way too hard for this run. Please, just a line. Dang. There it is. So that's why it's worth keeping some runs alive. Do you see how many points that thing was? Late game Tetrises make you rich. Um, I'm gonna cool off for a sec. Nah, let's not cool off. Let's do this. Alright, alright, alright. Alright. Nah, I'm going for that three. We'll take it. Nice and clean. Keep it clean. Um, put you up there. Ugh, that sucks. If only he knew.
keep it clean. We're doing fine. Mmm, <gasps> these boxes. Can I get it over there? Nope. <laughs> Sucks. Oh, I didn't realize we're at level 18. Yeah, there's no way you can get that box over there at this level. Can I do that? Nope. Oh, sucks. All right, let's see on that run. Another good run, though. That was another good run. That was another good run. I'm not ashamed of that one. Uh, we didn't give up on it, and we got a pretty good score in the end. It's hilarious you are saying rivers and lakes. That was not an option at that point. <laughs> Yeah, you can't do rivers and lakes until you're at the bottom. I was trying to get down there. What's your max number of lines? I don't keep track of my lines, uh, Hercules. Um, really just keep track of score. Mishkin subscribed through Twitch Prime. Thank you, Mishkin. And that was slightly higher than our last one. And everyone was calling that last run God Tier, but uh, it turns out that stinky run with a couple of late game Tetrises turned out to be a higher score. So yeah, it's a weird game. That's why we practice in the hyperbolic time chamber, you know? Alright, let's do a little B-type. Roketsu86 subscribed seven months in a row. Thank you, Roketsu. Struggled a little too long figuring out where that goes. Uh-oh, am I losing my voice already? It might not be a late a late night tonight, everybody. It's already 12.48, good grief, after just two runs. I mean, those two runs were solid runs. They weren't runs that we bailed on, you know? They were two good runs. It's cool. collection of lines. So again, yeah, cool. What I was going to say before the line appeared is we can't buy into our own superstitions. We can't say, because I got three lines in a row right now, uh, lines will not come for a while. Line came. Look at you, Joey. You're the best, dude. Uh, if you missed why I keep saying Joey's the best, uh, Joey is the J piece. Very common. Uh, so you can make lots of setups for Joey, for the, the J piece, and uh, you can make them with confidence. You can know that a new J is coming, and it's going to help you out, and work you out of whatever bad situation you have created for yourself. Let's we'll see if we can do this. Can we do this? Oh, no. Dang. I think a pro masher could have done that. That might just mean I'm an old man. <laughs> really caused a lot of cleanup. Cleanup crew is not happy about that one. You know what I haven't figured out is how old Wozniak was when he got the record that we're trying to beat. Alright, I'll give you that one. Uh, if I put the S piece in that undesirable spot on the far right, we could have had a Tetris immediately. Instead, we delayed it. That kind of thinking, not a huge factor down here at level 9. Up at level 18, we can't afford those kinds of moments. They will kill us. Tetris doing everything it can to not give me the Joey there. Alright. We're good. Decent looking Tower of Spite. That's a healthy Tower of Spite right there. Nice. Our Tetris is here for us. Mm hmm. Yeah. I 
don't know, Joey. A little scary. And that's why we love Joey, right there. That's 100% why we love him. Best in the biz right there. Someone in chat said lots more time to ripen. Oh, it was Jeff Goldblum's laugh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I still have lots of time to ripen still. Um, that was me thinking there's no way I'm getting a line next piece, which turned out to be true there. But again, that's just confirmation bias. It's not like I was right. Strategically. However, the thing that I wanted to happen came true. Whew! Nice. We're doing fine this run, though, right? Dang. We're having some good runs tonight. Despite my warnings. Nice. Good time for a box. Who knew? Uh, <laughs> Evets Kanezow just subscribed. Uh, very clever name, very clever subscription. I appreciate it. You are my nemesis. We'll take it. We'll take that. Uh, uh, yeah, and then we hope for a line? Or a T, I mean? Just clean it up. See if I can do- oh my god, what am I thinking? Man. Okay, we're, we're fine there, I just- wow. That was a lot of, uh, brain dysfunctioning there. That was Old Man Bossman. There he was, full effect. Midnight Bossman. Bossman after dark. Beautiful. And that, that's some young 20s Kyle right there. Oh, oh no, there he is. There's old man Bossman again. That's the end of that run. We can't get anything over there. Oh, that sucks. And there, there's old man Bossman. Dang. Mm. So yeah, that's just another, uh, that's a run that ended because of a dumb mistake. Oh well. I mean, if a line just came, if we had a line there, would, I mean, we would have had a Tetris and the run would have kept going. It just sucks. 20s Kyle, same age as Mario. Yeah, that move right there, that was some 24-year-old 20, Mario stuff. I need to turn my fan on. It's getting hot in here. Uh, below 200k, we give you nothing. You're nothing to us. Uh, let's do that. Ooh, this is a bad looking start. I used to, um, if I had a start like this, would just reset. I would say, nope, too ugly. Ooh, and it just turned too ugly. Yep. Joey put me over the line. That was just too ugly of a start. Not interested. Like, this is already so ugly, too. Good grief. Generally, you just don't want S's and Z's as your first pieces. You want to build the setups for S's and Z's. Need some Y's. I don't know, should I take some time and pull up some Y's? I don't, I'm not really uh, set up over here for any Y's. We'll see, we'll see if we need them. I'll defer to you, chat. No other spot, unfortunately. Yeah, I deserve that. Mm -hmm. 
It's all good, baby. It's all good. One thing I noticed a lot about Kyle Bossman is he says baby a lot. And I don't know if this is too personal, but I wonder if, like, he calls his girlfriend's baby. I don't think of him as that kind of guy, but it just comes out of his mouth so much that I wonder if that's, like, the kind of person he is. I just don't want to think of him that way. I think most of us are just better off thinking it as him and just someone who never dates anyone or anything. It's kind of this, uh, androgynous cyborg, I guess. It's how I like to envision him. It's really the only way it makes sense. I don't get him otherwise. What's his endgame? What's he trying to get at? Seems to me he doesn't even try to get better at Tetris. Honestly, I, sometimes I'm scared that he's just playing a weird long prank on us. But I can't look away. I suppose that's the appeal, really. Thank you for listening to my report. Okay, so Nathan... The assignment was to, uh... Tell us about someone you admire, um, and it kind of seems like you don't like this uh, Bozeman figure. Oh, it's true, I don't like him at all, but in, in some sick way I do admire him. This is what he refers to as the Bosman Complex. All of the easy allies have it. I'm sorry, what is the easy allies? Did I leave that out of my report? Yes, Nathan, but please, don't go into it. We've heard enough from you. You failed. Okay. I'll have to tell my mom. She won't be happy about this. Hey, Mom. I did it again. I failed. Nathan, what? Did you... Did you make another report about Kyle Bossman for no reason? Yes. You need to stop it, Nathan. He's not good for you. He's just junk food, Nathan. And I'm going to show you something. Okay, I'm going to show you a good thing to watch. His name is Markiplier. And he makes sense, Nathan. His videos are funny, Nathan. Look at this. He has joke structure I can follow, Nathan. He has a positive message, Nathan. He does good things for charity. I, I know. I've seen this guy before. I, I'm not... It just doesn't do it for me. I don't know what to say. Other than get out of this house. <sighs> I'll choose to... Hitchhike across the world. 
before I write one book report about a fireman. Or a lawyer, or some other role model you expect me to respect. Nathan goes up to his room. Obviously his mom's not going to kick him out of the house. He opens his diary. To page 347. And it says, My plan is almost complete. I will destroy Bossman from the inside. I'm so close, I can taste it. Sincerely, Nathan. Now, how could this possibly be part of his plan to destroy Kyle Bossman? Was he trying to draw attention to his own failures and maybe create some sort of initiative where people blame the lunacy of Kyle Bosman on a couple handfuls of high school children failing their classes around the world? Or is there something more complicated than that? That is what I would like you to determine. Detective Smiths. That's what I've hired you for. Now, I don't have a lot of money, so I can only afford you for two weeks. If you can't solve this case in that amount of time, I guess I just have to wait and see what Nathan comes up with. Now, that's not normally the type of Arrangement. I like to put myself in, Mr. Bossman. However, I'm desperate for a case. That's not, you know, some husband or wife trying to catch their wife or husband cheating. It's 99% of my cases. Frankly, I'm happy to see anything else right now. Take your case, as always. Can't promise results. Who should I talk to first? And I want to do your job for you. But why not Nathan's best friend, Coogan? Alright, I'll talk to Coogan. Three knocks on the door. Nothing. No response. Three more knots. Coogan! Three more knots. Coogan! Coogan, are you home? The detective smashes the door open. Only to find Coogan murdered. Murdered! Cut open. Blood everywhere. Now, believe it or not, this is the first time this detective has ever seen murder. He coughs, covers his face in disgust. He's never seen anything like this. Should he stay? Should he call the cops? He doesn't have a good relationship with the cops. He's an ex-cop himself. Left the force when uh, he caught his wife cheating. A little bit of backstory there kind of explains why he doesn't have much of a taste for all these cases where he just has to find people cheating.
Good grief, everybody. This run sucks. They're making me work so hard for this. Let's, all right, let's get a Tetris right here. Let's rally. Let's get a little rally going. Let's get a Tetris. We need it. Don't be rude, Tetris. Just let us have one. Don't be rude. There we go. Whew. Almost thought it would never happen. We're good. I see some theories in chat about what happened to Coogan. <laughs> it's like, was it obviously Nathan? Like, Nathan did it, right? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's the end of that run. 18, level 18 gets me again. Alright, 299, that ain't bad. Let's wise up next round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was just a bad round that I really smashed through. <clears throat> that one, they they made me work too hard for that one. Ooh, Nathan's mom. That's a good one. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, I see too many requests for some David Wise. Um, what did you say? Jungle Falls? Let's see. Turbo Chicken Man wants Jungle Falls. I'm gonna look it up. Oh, it's a Diddy Kong racing track. I think that's David Wise too. Let's check it out. All right, I'll, I'll play this. I'm open to requests. Uh, we're over 200K, we'll put our name in. We're not ashamed of that. Mm, the teacher that hates Bossman, I see that. Is the murderer of Coogan. <laughs> Why did they kill Coogan? <laughs> oh, it ain't right. It ain't right. Alright, so Diddy Kong Racing, a game I've never played actually. Here we go. Uh, this might be the second to last run, everybody. I'm not I don't know how much endurance I have tonight for you to be honest. That's a reset. I don't want to deal with this castle. We don't have time for this. If I'm only doing two more runs, that's not going to be one of them. So this is clearly, like, um, racing music. I don't know if it's right for Tetris. We'll see how we do. Kyle, why even move the time back to midnight? Oh, I had to. It was a uh, scheduling necessity this week. Next week, absolutely back to 11. It's a bummer. I'll give you a little insight into Kyle's world. Um, we were going to do... So it's, it's a New Money show. New Money is my uh, sketch team here in LA. That uh, We had our last uh, show, last weekly show, back in February. Um, and Oh, so it's at UCB, the UC Upright Citizens Brigade Theater in LA. Uh, basically, they create teams that have six writers and six actors on them. Uh, if you're around for too long, they graduate you, and we got graduated in February. So this was our first show since then, um, which is kind of cool, uh, but a lot of the actors couldn't make it, and we're going to do one of my favorite sketches ever, um, which is online, actually, I think. 
uh, about some teenagers from the Bronx who find a mummy. Um, which is awesome. I, I mean, I, I love this sketch. It's, to me, like, the closest I got to finding my voice as a sketch writer, you know? Uh, just a sketch that re I really feel like is my perspective. Um, which sounds douchey. This is why I don't really normally talk about this stuff. Anyway, uh, this is just how, like, life goes. Is, um, we, we were all set to do it, and Echo, one of the, ac the actors, uh, was asked to do an extra scene on set, you know? <laughs> and so it's like, uh, hey, I can't make it to the show. I have to stay in Canada tonight. You know, it's just like that. It's just, that's, uh, real life. Of an actor, I guess. And so we had to cut that scene, and to cut that sketch. Spomer, heartbreaking. Um, I gotta say, I mean, look at the Diddy Kong. We're getting results from Diddy Kong Racing. Maybe the vibes are right. Maybe the vibes are right. Maybe the vibes are right. You see me doing a lot of cleanup lines. Uh... I think we've been on a drought for a while here, waiting for that line to come. Ooh, that's some good mashing. Yeah, let's we'll get that back to back. You owed us. We'll take it. Hmm. That's kind of impossible to deal with. So what do we do with this? All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Uh, it kind of feels like Ninja Turtles music. Hyperstone Heist. As you would say. Yeah, maybe we should try some Turtles music. Couldn't hurt, right? <sighs> I'm seething right now. It's frustrating Tetris. get to 200. It's fine. Nice. The double L. We like it. Yeah, I gotta say, maybe it was a generational thing. Uh, Diddy Kong Racing looked dorky to me. Uh, I really did not like the design aesthetic of N64 era rare creatures with their stupid eyes. Always kind of bland. I don't know. I just really didn't dig them. They just looked like they were made for idiot kids. Like, the kids don't know better, it's fine. Just put it out there. Obviously, I love the design of Donkey Kong. Holds up. So I won't say that all rare designs are bad. But if you look at most of the characters in Diddy Kong Racing, 
They're disgusting. Don't put them in a game. That's actually not bad. Yeah, because we got the back to back lines. Cool. We'll take it. It's level 11. We can handle putting a line up there like that. Uh, in the future, no. But we're still pretty low gravity. We can handle it. And we did. So right there, I'm counting out a Joey to appear. And look at that, Joey comes up, and then we're not in a jam. So that's how cool Joey is. Joey is the best piece in the game. Fan favorite, Joey Wheeler. Kyle, do you think the dumb character design for ukulele looks dumb? Um, no. I think ukulele utilizes some... Um, The character themselves uh, isn't as bad as a typical typical rare design. I think there are some NPCs that might get a little uh, stupid looking. Okay. With their stupid eyeballs? I think I have a sneaking suspicion that ukulele is going to be pretty sweet. I still haven't tried it. I have not tried the uh, playable version that's out there right now. So I really can't speak to it personally. But I don't know, I just, uh, it's like a project I have faith in. For no reason. Goodwill, I guess. It's a level 14 Tetris. We like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, this track is not meant to be played for as long as we have been playing it. The loop is strong. There are no 15 minute races in Diddy Kong Racing. So if you ever wonder why I like to do a jagged edge at the curve just before the well, it's because uh, it's easier to get out of that mess. We gotta stick to our Tetris runs. Sorry if that kills us. Ah, sorry. That was too many in a row. And look, there's the line. I fell for the gambler's fallacy. I fell for it. Took the bait. Baited me and I took it. Doesn't feel good. Okay, Joey. Don't me down, bud. Nice, Joey.
Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Obviously, we're at rivers and lakes right now, chat. We are done getting Tetrises. Ooh! <laughs> Do you see our score right now? Oh, baby! That's a little Diddy Kong Racing right there. Of course it would be David Wise. Of course. Oh, what a pressure is lifted off my shoulders. Oh, yeah, I can't do this run anymore. I'm too pumped. I'm too pumped to do this run anymore. I never thought it would happen. I'm too... I'm sorry. I'm too pumped. I can't do it anymore. Chad, I'm so pumped. I'm so pumped. Okay, baby. <sighs> Renegade124, seven months in a row. Thank you, Renegade. What a chance to use that. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god, we did it. We got there. <sighs> oh my word. Extravaganza seven months in a row. Thank you, Extravaganza. <clears throat> what a weight that's been lifted. Okay. <laughs> Diddy Kong Racing Goat Kart Racer confirmed. <laughs> BJ Detweiler, I hear you. Uh, you made a great case. <sighs> By the way, this is my first ever GIF. It's the first ever GIF I ever made. It's pretty cool. Let's do it. Let's put our name in there. Let's lock that in. Oh my god. And on what? On such a like a. A stinky, sleepy night, too. The power of wise. Whew. That's it for the night. We're not. We're not doing another run after that. That's it. Let's see who guessed tonight that we would get to four zero eight eight one five. Let me put it in too. It's gonna feel good. Uh, any other night, everybody, I would say, you know, normally we do a thing. We say, all right, this is the final run. We put on special music for the final run. That's a night. I'm already super tired. I have a ton of work to do tomorrow. Uh, a lot of Easy Allies work to do tomorrow. Uh, if I can go to bed 20 minutes early, I will take that opportunity. So, all right, we're going to dig in. Let's see who Boswaz Bot said is the closest. Four zero eight five one nine. Is that right? Enter. Oh my gosh. Our winner tonight is 509 off. Very close. Very nice bet. Um, the next was 693, also very close. But this person, you're too much closer. You get full credit. You will pilot the Baron. Let me put you in there. I gotta warn you, everyone, it was not a tie. It was not close to a tie. <laughs> My voice hurts with somebody in the top 10. Good name, I like it. My voice hurts too. I really fell apart there. I got too excited. It got to that point where I, I like couldn't even play beyond the 400. The thing is, I I can give, I can go much beyond 400. It's just we we've never done it on stream. I thought it would never happen. Feels good. All right. There you are. I think you're in. Let me triple check that. This, the, this is where I need my tech team. Yep, you're in. Okay. All right. So <laughs> I think I can finally get rid of that GIF. It's been on for too long. All right. Boop. Oh, nice and clean. 
nice and pristine. Okay, uh, let me back up. We're going to B-type. We're going to get the Buran. If you don't know what I'm talking about, the Buran is the reward for completing B-type. You go to level 9, you go to height 5. B-type is an insanely hard version of Tetris where it's just a mess. And the idea is to flex your cleanup crew skills, which were pretty on point tonight, I have to say. All right, so yeah, we died. You die quick. You die fast. You die a lot. It's not easy. Um, I guess we hope for a box, huh? Box came, and then maybe a second Joey we'll hope for. No second Joey. So there's, like, no time. There's no time to wait for a second Joey in B-Type. You can't really hang around and build stuff. Oh, God. All right. Mm-hmm. Alright. One thing I like about B-Type is the weird... It definitely lets the first piece hang for a second. As a courtesy to you, the player. Nice. That is actually perfect. Um, alright. Mm-hmm. Oh god, no, no. Alright. Clearly, I mean, my mind is not in the right spot. Kyle, we need a Tet piece as one of the custom badges. Uh, yeah. It would have to be Joey, right? But it, that would, then we would spam it too much. I guess I'd want to know what piece it would be and how to properly utilize it. Maybe the line. I like to create emotes that have an apparent functionality. Like Smug Blood. You know exactly when to use Smug Blood. Backseat Bossman, even when he's tiny, exhibits a clear emotion. Oh, didn't want a box there, that sucks. Oops, oh, that's on me. Wrong piece there. Okay. I gotta focus up, everybody. This is why NFL teams never win Super Bowls two years in a row. You lose your focus. Ooh, I got a little cute. Paid off. That was really cool. That could have gone very poorly. A Tetris in B-type is actually very rare. We almost never do that. It's the second time we've ever done it on Boss Movie Wozniak. You really can't afford to be trying to be that cute in this mode. Kyle, it's no emotes. Every channel gets custom badges for X amount of months subbed and such. Oh! Huh. I suppose I'm gonna have to do a little research. But was that another thing that was just announced today? That's very cool. Yeah, I would love to reward those of you who subscribe for many months in a row. With some custom badges. stuff. One more line. There it is. Okay, let me ready our Buran pilot. Tonight's Buran pilot. V8 Dave. Your name will be more visible once we get the clear skies for the launch of the Buran. Congratulations, V8 Dave. Yeah, you said uh, 408 something. You were not far off. And so you may pilot the Buran. Godspeed, V8 Dave. Take care of her out there. Say hi to the stars for us. The moon, and any planets you come across. You believed in us, and so now we believe in you. Come 
congratulations. Good job, BA Dave. Thank you for believing in me. Thank you for going high when all the others refused to believe that I would ever break 400k. Okay, so I did that same bet eight weeks in a row, says V8 Dave. <laughs> I guess that's one way to play the game. If you do the same bet over and over and over, eventually it's going to pay off. Nice, V8 Dave. I love that. That's very, very cool. All right, so next week's goal... I'm going to keep it 400 001. I'm going to try to consistently beat 400k before we move into the 410s and the 420s. Uh, obviously, this is not something I can do consistently, and it's something that I want to do consistently if we're ever going to start to get to the 500ks. I'm going to have to make a whole new GIF. Maybe we'll do a 450, 450k. Um, cool. Thank you so much for tuning in, everybody. Uh, that has been Bossman v. Wozniak for the night. That was a good good stream. Good little hour and a half right there. Um, <laughs> why do I feel so bad? Uh, I just get run down. I'm not sick or anything. It's just uh, been awake for too long. Need to get some rest. Okay. Um, what's up? Oh, you know what? I wanted to share a story. I wanted to share a personal moment with you. On this night of 400K, why not? Uh... A really funny thing happened. So yeah, uh, we did live with YouTube Gaming, the premiere this week. That's my job now, is working as a segment producer on that show. I was, uh, I got to do a segment called Dear Bossman on the show. Uh, when I was hired on, it was not to do a segment. It was not to uh, be on camera. It was to be the segment producer. So, you know, it's kind of lucky that I got this opportunity to do that. Anyway, um, <laughs> what happened was, it was actually like in chat on... Live with YouTube Gaming, not a lot of people were watching live. I'll explain that part later. Um, so yeah, the audience was not as huge as it should have been, as it needs to be, basically. But anyway, uh, when my segment came up, Dear Bossman, apparently in chat, obviously I couldn't see it at the time, uh, there was a lot of support for me. There was a lot of like, oh, Bossman's on. This is great. This is good. Uh, afterward, I found out that uh, the YouTube uh, people... I, I, won't identify any of them, were really excited about that. But, uh, you know, because they were excited to see anything light up. And uh, afterward, someone walked up to me and said, um, hey, man, a lot of people, uh, you know, they were going nuts in chat when you were up. I was just wondering, um, I mean, you, you don't have a lot of Twitter followers. And I don't mean to be mean here, but uh, you don't have a lot of subscribers. Um, I'm just wondering where they all came from. <laughs> <laughs> so you know not it's just it's unusual I think on their end to see it, that much support for someone who doesn't have a lot of Twitter followers or, or doesn't have a lot of subscribers on YouTube uh, and so I wanted to say thanks to you personally uh, for supporting me in moments like that uh, for being there at that time and being here at this time uh, that's not lost on me I really truly appreciate that and uh that was cool. That was, you know, I know that you're there for me, and I really appreciate that. That um, that gets to my heart, and uh, that's it. That's all. I just wanted to tell that story. I'm getting a little emotional. Though. That's weird. It's late. I think it's just late. Um, what's coming up on Easy Allies tomorrow morning? <laughs> Huber's doing uh, his live thing, uh, talking syndrome, and then immediately after that, we're gonna shoot a bunch of D and D. So that'll be cool. And I think that's it for this weekend. And so uh, Monday, I'm doing uh, Dumb Game Monday, of course. Hopefully wrapping up Spyro, Legend of Spyro, Dawn of the Dragon. It was killing me last week. Last week was a rough stream. I'm hoping that we got like one more environment and one boss fight. I hope that's it. It is. Dumb Game Monday is about learning to love a dumb game. Spyro is making it hard, as many of the last games have. It's been. A, it's basically a challenge stream, like this game is. Challenge to get a high score. Dumb Game Monday is the challenges love this game. And uh, Legend of Spyro Dawn of the Dragon is a dumb game. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, check out patreon.com slash easy allies to see how you could uh, support us. Uh, see what we're about even. What the easy allies are about. Uh, I see many of you have subscribed. Uh, not just through um, uh, regular Twitch, but also through this new crazy Twitch Prime. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Bloodworth says Game Sleuth soon. I never trust that. I don't, Blood, don't even tease it. 
Don't ever t when Damiani says something is coming soon, don't believe it. <laughs> Just always ask for receipts. Uh, it's good stuff coming though. Game Sleuth will be pretty cool when it finally comes out. Uh, so look forward to that next week. And oh my God, something I'm very excited about. Another thing <laughs> I got to work on this weekend. Wednesday, the group stream night is going to be a concert for Brad. I think six of us lost to Brad in a betting special and a betting exhibition special. And because we entered the betting exhibition special, the stakes were if we were to lose, we'd have to write a song about the winner. Uh, thank you, L Reality, for subscribing through Twitch Prime. Appreciate that. Thank you. Um, so all six of us are going to perform or debut our music video uh, for songs about Brad on our group stream. It's going to be really fun, a stupid concert for Brad. Uh, I'm personally excited to see what everyone else has come up with. I'm also excited to see what all I'm able to come up with this weekend. We'll see. Uh, and so, yeah, I think that's going to be really, really fun. Uh, so check that out. All right, everybody. Uh, that's enough rambling for tonight. I'm going to mute my own mouth. I'm going to uh, wave to you, you goodbye, and I'm going to play you out with the best music that Tetris has to offer, the music that plays when you've gotten a high score, and we certainly did that tonight. Okay, everybody. All right. Uh, see you later. My, mute my microphone.